Okay, we got a Toyota VVTI, I think, variable valve timing gear. This is off a 2009 Matrix. I got the typical rattle that a lot of people talk about on startup. I replaced it uh, with one from a junkyard and it has been quiet. Let's see if we can figure out what's going on with this one. Seems nobody can figure out the size and kind of bit. This is a Torx Plus 5.T30 that fits these. I haven't even broken them loose yet. Let's see what she does. Well, they're tight. Gonna need a torque, a uh, impact. All right, let's try this again with an impact. I need a stronger impact. Wow, they don't mean for them things to come out of there. Get a bigger hammer. One more time. Everything looks pretty good. No broken off ears. And most of the little plastic things seem to be making decent contact. Spring's not broken. And it was in fact an engage in the pin in the car. I verified that when I took it off. So that wasn't really the issue. And doesn't look too war. No burrs. Don't really know. I see nothing majorly wrong with it. Here's all the parts. Nothing really seems to be worn. Plastic all the springs. Uh, I 
do notice that these springs don't really stay in and I'm not sure if they're supposed to but you would kind of think that they would fit but I guess not no the only thing I noticed on this one is there is some sludge build up in these corners it's kind of really hard to see you can see it there some of these I've already wiped clean but with that sludge build up if that's the only thing that was wrong with this then that kind of leads me to believe that cleaning some kind of fl oil flush or something may have actually taken care of this problem which would have been a whole lot easier but uh, not cheaper on me I spent a total of 20 bucks on this fix so I don't have anything definite to say other than I do know that it is a Torx Plus 5 point T 30 bit that fits them and they're in there pretty tight.